And here, here, oh, here it is, I forgot. Oh my god. <laughs> How's it going, everybody? Doy here with a very unexpected video for you all today. It is, what, 4 a.m. over here on the East Coast where I am. You know, I was doing some other stuff. I refreshed YouTube five minutes ago. Bandai Namco Europe dropped what I thought was a Gogeta trailer initially, but it's actually just some more gameplay from Gogeta, albeit in a bit of higher quality. And also, there is another thing that absolutely blew me away. So I had to stop because this is definitely video worthy. Not only is the higher quality alone interesting to me, but uh, you know what? Let's just wait till we see it. Let's just wait till they see it because they definitely showed off a few new supers. So in the gameplay, they start off with this intro. I'm super glad I get to see this in 1080p quality, finally, uh, because man, it looked good in the TGS and it only looks better here. Gogeta's intro still easily takes number one in the game for me. Uh, but it's actually in the gameplay, which I think I will skip here. Uh, by the way, spoilers, they don't get the dramatic finish. I did skip ahead just to see if they do that, because, man, I was looking forward to it. But no, no dramatic finish, unfortunately, so we skip ahead here, uh, and we got, start to see Gogeta in action. Right away? Dude, I underestimated that range. It's not too crazy, and I guess yeah, Janemba did move him forward, but that is a pretty nice hitbox. I must admit, the, the jabs looked a little lower to me. Uh, that might have been a quality issue, but here... This looks like a normal that has some weight to it. Uh, not as annoying as Vegito, obviously, but definitely pretty good. Uh, then we see what I believe to be his 2M or his 2L. Uh, it is confirmed that Vegito has those two options, 2L and 2M, uh, for the slide and then this m maneuver. Uh, but yeah, I didn't catch on to that in the um, TGS gameplay. This is a full auto combo, so he does get the roll behind and then opts to go for what some people believe is his down heavy, but it might be a normal considering what happens uh, with this other one, but it's still unknown. Just some random Gogeta on block. You see he enters his stance there. Uh, that's That move I'm looking forward to using a lot. Here, we see a smash property here. I'm not sure what that means, but either way, he still finishes with a Rekka. And here, here, oh, here it is, I forgot. Oh my God. <laughs> that looks crazy good. Let me go back just because before that was interesting as well. So he follows the smash and then goes into that kick again. And then he just does another combo. I'm gonna let this play out. I don't have too much to say other than it's insane. This is another super Gogeta has that is just wild. This whole thing, by the way, is just one bar. You get all of this for one bar on Gogeta Blue, bro. That is what kind of is the, the craziest thing about it to me. Uh, but let's seriously go back and talk about that Rekka, because in gameplay, I think that's a little more important than the level one. But uh, I, I'd argue against that point, personally. So right here, when he does this kick, it actually kind of looks like if we can pause on the correct frame, let's just... Nope, that's five seconds, my bad. So right there, that kind of looks like an on-block effect. Um, I don't really think that's going to matter too much. It might be bad for hit confirms, but I don't think you're going to want to be doing this move to hit confirm anything. Uh, so yeah, after this kick, Gogeta gets uh, some Rekka-like follow-ups. I don't think the choices matter too much. Uh, but yeah, he just brings it down, which gives you sliding. Uh, that to me indicates that post-vanish, Gogeta will get um, you know, a nice sliding move. Uh, just basically an option that gives Gogeta a chance to always confirm. Let me go back and make sure he didn't spend any bar here. Uh, he does the stance. Doesn't combo stance. You cannot combo with at least that move. I don't think he spends any bar here using that crazy jump M we talked about. No, no bar. So he can do that safely. That's very Videl-like. Uh, Videl can do a kick like that in the air at any times to guarantee a sliding as well. Now we're just going back to go, you know, you got to give Cooler some shots. Still using that JM. And the after image confirms there and you can... Pause. I did not notice that. What is this? Oh, he's using the other super. And the level two spirit ball. Oh my God. Thank you for uploading this Bandai. That's that's the other one. Okay, real quick. That's the slide I'm talking about. I think that's his down L, uh, two L, if I'm to be correct. But hold on. There was so much there, bro. I, th you know what? My sleeping schedule is trash, but that's okay. This is This was worth it. All right, so really quick here. Let's talk about the, um, the implications of this. He gets the combo off the beam and teleports to the person. That's great corner carry. That is insane corner carry, actually, because right here, Cooler ends up practically in the corner. He's still got a little bit of space, but uh, just in general, where did that hit from? Was it? Hold on. Was that a DP? I am going to cry if that... No, bro. No. Not another DP care. Please tell me that. Please tell me I'm seeing something wrong here, bro. You can't, you can't be serious. Oh no. I know there's a way to skip frames, but... Oh, that looks like a DP, bro. I'm going to be so upset. Gogeta's top tier. That cannot be a DP, but I think it is. Oh my goodness. Where did he start this combo is what I was really interested in. I really like that, actually. I wonder how he does the, the kick cancel. Either way, we gotta move on. Let's watch these supers one more time, because they're 
They're definitely worth it. Sliding 2L, we talked about that a little earlier. It's nice to have a slide DP. Please don't be a DP. But it looks like a DP. Oh, God. Here comes Janemba. They're just going to... They're just going to let Gogeta style on a fast beat. What the? Oh, my God. Gogeta's top tier. <laughs> there is no way, bro. Krillin can't do that. And Krillin's beam is the best in the game, in my opinion. But... I mean, Goku's beam is pretty good, too. Let's not lie. Let's not lie. All right, hold on. Let's watch that again. Take that from the top. Watch how fast these beams are. If you can't super dash through that, that's one hit. Downward angle beam. That was pretty... That was a little slower than the horizontal, but I don't think it mattered too much. Standard B and B for Go, uh, Gogeta here. Yeah, it looks like that's just going to be your standard go-to route. Uh, playing defense here. What was that? Was that another... I don't think that was a DP. He just used it in like a Team Gohan DP manner. Where am I? Did I not skip backwards? Oh, I didn't. <laughs> I was like, what's going on? He's not DP. Thought I rewrote time. Yeah, so that's just a crazy jab. What do you get off that? You can definitely combo. You might even be able to follow the super dash. All right, blocking against Broly here. Nothing too fancy gets hit. Wow. Hey, that's not how you do Broly's BNB. Hey, what? I don't want to watch Goku Blue. Nah, we skipping this. All right, he's back. He's back. They knew they had to bring him back. Wait, did they DHC? Hold on. Oh, they were just switching. They were like, oh, I'm going to get fired. <laughs> they were like, I got to switch. I got to switch. This is not a Goku Blue gameplay. Okay, so Janemba comes in. This is where they're going to wrap it up. 2M? This is definitely his 2M. All right, that damage confirms it for me. Standard stuff. Okay, we've seen that a lot. Level 3, and he... My boy finished with 5 bars. Okay, I see you. It, the Goku Blue is just a plan to get 5 bars. Oh, he didn't need it. Never mind, bro. You might want to watch out for your boss. <laughs> and then we get Gogeta's outro, a reference to the uh, uh, Janemba movie, or his for Fusion Reborn, I believe. Boom, in the pose. Mom thinks he's very handsome. Nice haircut, Gogeta. Had to flex on him. Well, that's pretty much all I got to say for the... Oh, I thought this was a date. I lost my, I, I lost it, right? I thought that was a date. Well, that's good. I'm just going to let the gameplay play in the background to say my final thoughts. Uh, this character has me... Probably the most excited I've been for a character since, uh... I don't know, I'm excited for every Dragon Ball Fighters character, but this is the most exciting since Bardock and Broly, I think. Uh, those two were real exciting just because they were the first and also they're big characters. But man, I'm, I'm stoked for Gogeta. I'm, I'm psyched to see the full dramatic finish with Janemba. That is confirmed. There is one. I saw some people confused about that. It's coming out in, uh, September 26th. So yeah, Gogeta is coming September 26th. That is relatively soon. I didn't think I'd be doing another video on him before that date, but we got this. So it was a must have. So yeah, that's where it ends. I also think Gogeta looks very good. If you were worried about him being bottom tier, I would get that out of my mind completely. Just those beams alone, I think makes him at least mid tier. I think having a good beam game in this game uh, makes it pretty, you're pretty gonna, you're gonna be okay. Uh, he also has a DP, which makes me think he's gonna be okay, especially online. So if you play a lot of online, you're like, man, I just hope I can use Gogeta. I just he can't be too bad. Uh, I don't think you have anything to worry about. Other than that, all I can say for Gogeta is I cannot wait to play him personally. I can't see, wait to see what people do with him. Seriously though, guys, I've never looked forward more to a week of ranked uh, covering all the tech combos, stuff like that on the channel. So you're definitely gonna wanna subscribe to stick around if any of that stuff interests you. Also, let me know down below in your comments uh, whether or not you're looking forward to this character after this extra gameplay. And while you're down there, if you like the video, make sure to hit the like button as well. There's also some more videos up on your screen right now, including our old Gogeta gameplay stuff. So if you want to watch more stuff about Gogeta, I would check that out. But other than that, more Gogeta stuff is definitely coming. So thank you guys so much for watching. I have been Dr. Doya, and I will see you in the next video.